What is happening everybody? It is I once again and today I really need to come up with a new intro. That's what I need to do. Let's do this again today. Um I had I woke with a terrible craving. Kinda hungry last night, kinda took care of it, but when you don't sate those cravings, they catch up to you. And I had a craving last night. And I woke up thinking, oh, the craving had to have passed. Nope. So I went and took care of it a little while ago. What we got for you today is 7 Eleven large pizza, meat. Can you see that? Hope I'm not spilling it. I don't know if you can see that or not. I couldn't see the camera. And some barbecue wings. Now, comes down to uh, money. Um, the pizza is five fifty-five, and the wings, ten wings, are six ninety-nine. So what? Seven bucks. Round this up to another six. You got what? Thirteen dollars right there. Well, they have a special right now at 7-Eleven. Large pizza, 10 wings, 10 bucks flat. Had to go for it. I just had to go for it. I've never had their barbecue wings, and that's what I ordered here. And I've never had their meat pizza, their meat lovers pizza, I guess. I don't know if it's called meat lovers or just meat or what. They got pepperoni, cheese, and meat. Um, had pepperoni plenty of times. It's okay. I uh, haven't had their cheese pizza. It looks good, but today I just needed something with a little more sustenance to it. So let's uh, let's see what's up with this. Looks like it's got some pepperoni, the um, sausage, and it looks like Canadian bacon, ham. Mmm. Let's get down on this. Mm. The crust has this little dusting down here. Looks like cornmeal or something. I'm not sure, but it adds to the crispiness. Overall, the crust is it's hit and miss. It's got kind of like a spongy feel to it, but a crispiness that forgives it. Hmm. Pretty good. Even if I would have paid full price, which was only what fifty-five cents more, not a big difference. Um, but yeah, getting a little cheaper than usual is a nice bonus. But yeah, I'd pay I'd pay five fifty-five for this. I'd I'd get this one again. The cheese is really good. It says on there made with real milk. And that's all they say. <laughs> if you can milk it, then you know what I mean? Am I getting milk from a cow, from a goat, pig, a rat? What am I getting here? I don't know, but I like it. Um, the last time I got wings from there, they didn't offer me ranch. I had to get it, get it separate. Nobody said, hey, you want some ranch? They did today. Try a little ranch. I like ranch on my pizza sometimes. Anybody else? Mm. 
kills me when people don't eat the crust. They throw the crust in the box like it's not part. That's you're like throwing away a whole other meal. Breadsticks, man. That's how I treat them. Papa John's has a very thick crust, very bready, the, the end part. So I'll eat the pizza down to the crust and then leave a pile of them there and then I'll start dipping it in that garlic butter that they give you. I mean, I could order some breadsticks, but... Breadsticks and pizza? I don't know. Kind of pointless to me. Probably about as pointless as drinking a uh, diet soda with all this pizza. How am I doing on power? Good. Good. All right. Well. Let's try some of these uh, wangs. Right off the back, until the skin is in this, like very crispy. It's kind of it's cooked, but it's kind of sticky. That's okay. Mmm. Mmm. I don't know. That barbecue flavor is a little kind of fail. It's um, it's a very almost sweet taste with a little bit of smokiness, but uh, it's all right. I guess I was expecting something a little more bold and savory. That meet everybody's approval there. No. I didn't get it right down to the cartilage. Come on, seriously. Life in the big city, I guess. Eh, we'll try it with a little ranch. The ranch seemed to have a little tanginess to it, so. Mmm. Mmm. That amped up the flavor a little bit. I mean, overall, I'm not too dissatisfied with the wings. They're they're okay. I, was, I guess I just had it in my mind that the barbecue was gonna have a little more of a, a little more on the spicy, savory side rather than sweet, you know. But it's not bad. Ooh, big old piece of cartilage. I've had a couple of suggestions to do the uh, Buffalo Wild Wing Blazing Wings Challenge. I don't know if I'm up for that yet. Kind of working my way through some other spicy ventures, but as soon as I get my head out of out of that game, I'll try and think about doing something a little more torturous. Um, it's got like, well, last time I checked, that Carolina Reaper sauce on it, which is like 350,000 Scoville. No, I'm sorry. Take that back. It's in the millions. It's in the millions. 350,000. That's like uh, habanero. So I'm not sure if I'm really up to that yet. I don't think I'll ever really be up to that because, like I've told you millions of times, I'm not big on really spicy stuff. I'll do it to try it, you know, to sample it, to, to bring it to you. Uh, challenges and stuff, I'm not that big on. I did the uh, fire wing, the fire noodle challenge. 
That was okay. I survived. Come to find out, those on, on the grand scheme of things, those noodles are not that hot. 10,000 Scovilles is, is hot for me, for the average go-getter, but there's a habanero ramen that I've shown you, I've unpackaged it. Yeah, I'm gonna try those, but those are like 350,000 Scoville. So, yeah. I don't know, I, I don't know how I'll feel after that. That may just turn me off to spicy things altogether or it may push me to try something just a little bit more. We'll see. Well, on a scale from one to 10, the pizza, if you get it fresh, you get it hot, hasn't been sitting under a lamp too long, it's not bad at all. And I'd have to go with like a, uh, a seven for the pizza. The wings, I'd give them a seven too. Um, they're cooked well. They don't have the crispiness that I like. I like crispiness, a little crispiness on the skin. Um, it's kind of there, but not much. The flavor, barbecue, ah. Like if I was just judging the flavor, I'd say a six for the barbecue, but overall the wings get a seven. They're, they're meaty, they're nice and meaty, they're not skimpy. So um, that aspect of it. Now you know what, I'll push it one more, eight. Seven for the pizza, eight for the wings. The wings are decent. They're they're good. You know they're they're satisfying. Um, they don't taste rank. They're not raunchy. It's not all bone. You know you take the skin off and there's like that part where the skin is the meat isn't covering the bone anymore. It's kind of weird looking. This is pretty comparable to the pepperoni. I mean, it's just a couple of extra meat flavors in there, but it's being overpowered by something else. I don't know if it's the pepper. There's some kind of pepper in there. The sauce is kind of bland. It's not sharp like most pizza sauces are. It's, it's a little on the bland side, but not uh, not bad, not bad. It's very bready. It's pretty, it's a lot of bread there. So, there you have it, guys. Sorry, this isn't a mukbang, mukbang video where I'm going to eat a whole pizza and all the wings and whatever's in the cupboards. I'm not going to do that. Two slices, having a little lunch, saving the rest for later. Might have something for dinner. I'm going to watch a few movies. Uh, probably have two more wings. Put those away for a while. Microwave them later. Thank God for nukes, right? I'm over talking away and I can't tell if I got anything in my mouth whatsoever. Guess I was okay. So thank you, one and all, for stopping by 7 Eleven Pizza. Gets the seven, the wings get the eight. Uh, go with whatever other flavors they have, but if you like barbecue, if you like sweet, you might be into that. Um, all the pizzas I think are pretty much comparable. I think the cheese might be the only one that might offer something a little different because it doesn't have all the meat flavor in it. Other than that, there's an overpowering sense of pepperoni on this no matter what you do, so you're gonna taste that more than anything else. But uh, yeah, eight for the wings, seven for the pizza, and if you can, catch them on their special, 10 wings, large pizza, together, 10 bucks. Save yourself a little coin. Use the extra money, buy yourself a drink. Right? They got a whole bunch of specials over there. Mini tacos. Like 10 of them for 2 bucks. Um, two chicken tenders, 2 bucks. Uh, a quarter pound big bite and a big gulp, 2 bucks. I mean, quick lunch, quick fix. Not bad. So until next time, guys, take care. Happy eating. And uh, I'll talk to you all real soon.